Emily, this is a look at the soft body armor deputies in the U Utah County Sheriff's Office are required to wear while on duty, but this armor doesn't protect against everything. This helmet is rated 3A. It will stop pistol rounds. A helmet and a vest. And they are actually level four, and these plates will stop rifle rounds. Utah County Sheriff Mike Smith says these are the two most important pieces of equipment inside their active shooter bags. And every member on his team is required to have it while patrolling. Our deputies go on calls actually quite often that involve, you know, a person with a gun or some other type of weapon. But that protection costs money. About $2,000 a bag. Sheriff Smith says they needed a grant to purchase them back in 2014. Before that, Smith says a lot of people got out their own wallets. You bought some surplus helmet that uh, it would probably work. I would, it's better than nothing, right? But they're old. Smith couldn't say how many other agencies have equipment like this, but he says more are making it a priority. We owe it to them to give them the proper protection to keep them safe. In this day and age, it's protection Smith says, sadly, every law enforcement agency in the country should have. But it doesn't do us any good to, to put our head in a hole and just hope it doesn't happen. Hoping it's never needed, but recognizing the responsibility that comes with it. Some of those tactics that keep for their safety are being set aside, and they're going to rush through an environment to get to where they believe the shooter is. Sheriff Smith says those roughly 90 bags do have a shelf life. The plates inside the vest have to be replaced roughly every five years, which is an added expense. But he says it's well worth it. Back to you.